Two-time lightweight contender Kenny Florian is making the move to featherweight. Florian began his career in the ultimate fighter as a 185-pound middleweight, but fast forward six years and K-Flo will be fighting 40 pounds lighter. The question we pose to you is can Kenny Florian be a future title challenger at 145 pounds? And there are plenty of people who are doubting if Florian can even make weight. He was never known as a small lightweight, and who knows how much the cut down will take out of him. If Florian is too drained from the cut come fight night, he may be in trouble. And let's not discount, by the way, the level of competition he'll be facing at 145 pounds. This Saturday at UFC 131, he takes on Diego Nunez. Nunez is 16-1 and, and has fought his entire career at a buck 45, so cardio and endurance will not be an issue. On the flip side, Florian is a two-time challenger to the lightweight crown, and the path to the featherweight title could be a shorter road. A win over Nunez would immediately put him at the top of the heap in the UFC's featherweight division, and he may be the biggest name in the weight class besides Jose Aldo. Florian Aldo is a marketable fight in a division that lacks high-profile fighters. Also, if Florian does make weight and looks good in doing so, he could pose quite a few problems to other fighters in the featherweight division. Again, the hot button question we pose to you is Kenny Florian a future title challenger at 145 pounds? To vote on the hot button question, just go to ESPN.com forward slash MMA forward slash hot.